Uh, <laughs> and for those, right. that, you, know you know what? I don't know anything about carrier IQ. Um, I know you wanted to get into that, and I, I, I don't know enough about it because I. Uh, I, well, I, 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 I can sum it up real quick. Uh, basically, I think, in my, in my personal opinion, everybody's directing this at Android, and this isn't me being an Android fan tart or anything. Uh, this is the fact that the reality is the people who asked Carrier IQ to be installed is AT&T, Sprint, and T-Mobile. Verizon has made a public announcement that says we did not request it. They're, they're trying to distance themselves from this as much as possible. There's, it, it's difficult to verify that at this point. But basically, uh, and, and why they wanted it, rather it was to have the ability to spy on people, to try and have more control of their customers, or if they just honestly wanted it for diagnostic reasons. Because what, what this application does is on your smartphone, whether it's iOS, because this was on iOS phones too, whether it's on iOS or Android or other smartphone OSs, it records the key combinations and other things. And, and the way you trigger it to log stuff, according to what's being reported, is you press like a key combination. Like on your cable box, you'll press buttons one, blah, blah, and blah, and it'll start doing stuff. But it's always running in the background, and you can't kill it. Uh, now, the it, Carrier IQ has stood up and said, we're not logging stuff by default. It's only logging stuff by default if the carriers have turned it on. Uh, so if your carrier did that to you, it has nothing to do with us. It's what they did. Uh, but I know when we attack a company that sells a service, to, I mean... Obviously, they're saying, look, we do, I guess, analytics is what I'm getting, or diagnostic, and some sort of analytics of some sort. Well, uh, it, 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 it's, is it, it's IQ. It's, that, I mean, it's to make. Yeah, it, it's smart, being right? directed at Android because, due to Android's open nature and the fact that you can, like, uh, talk to Android. Yeah, because carriers do whatever the hell they want with Android. Yeah, well, no, that wasn't, that wasn't, no, 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 that's not why it's directed at Android. The reason it's directed at Android is because this was shown to the world using an Android phone in diagnostic mode, where you could log all the stuff going on in terminal. Due to Android's open nature, it's very easy to do. So it was easy to show, look, it's logging my button pushes, it's logging what I'm doing. It's a, uh, say that again? Said it was key logging? Yeah, like when you press the certain buttons, it was, you know, it was recording that button push. It wasn't logging it, but it basically everything you did on the device went through Carrier IQ, which if it was in log mode, would log everything you did. It'd log your SNNs, it'd log your URLs, it'd log stuff. And it, and it was directing everything through it, for, uh, which a diagnostic software would have to do. Question. But Question. Go ahead. Um. Well, I guess, well, if you're browsing, you have to have data connection. But SMS goes through the, 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 the normal telephony protocols. Yeah, but at some point it has to go through the OS, and basically as all of this stuff went through the OS, it also went through Carrier IQ. Uh, and that's the concern people have here. It was shown on an Android device, which is why everything's getting shown on. Because Carrier IQ is what's front and center in the public. That is why, you How know, you have... How did this I mean, what, what, what was this about? How... How did this come about, this, this oh my god, Carrier IQ thing? Uh, 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 basically, um, hackers and engineers um, uh, discovered this and published it. You know, they put a video up on YouTube and basically said, look at this thing you can't kill, look what it's doing, look at... So I, they had to actually go through some legalese to keep it up there. Um, uh, and other things, uh, and it kind of went viral. Everybody's, what do you mean my phone's spying on me? You know, <laughs> that's, uh, but even the, the people who published it pointed out, this is not just an Android thing. This is a all smartphones thing. Then all the manufacturers started backing away from it, going, no, 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 we have nothing to do with Carrier IQ, talk to Carrier IQ. You know, they made it very clear, no AT&T, the phone company told us to put this on there. We had to do it or they wouldn't sell our phone. You know, basically everybody's running away from this as fast as they can. It, it, to put it in perspective, you remember a few years back, 
Uh, that one company that was renting computers got caught installing spyware on the computers, which mm -hmm. could, yeah, but they were their computers. That's the same. This that's what this is in a nutshell. This is this again. Okay, but that was an intentional company doing that. This is a the carrier IQ is a legitimate company, from what I can tell, that sells services to carriers that that obviously have chosen. Exactly. Let's, let's, let's be let's be very clear. Carrier IQ did not do some covert action. No. Uh, basically, the, the only thing Carrier IQ, the company, is guilty of is the phone company said, we want software that does this, and they said, okay, here's the software that does that. that I'm that's providing a service. Yeah, that's what they're guilty of. And that, 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 that again, it goes back to the blood-sucking carriers. You know, it, it's, it's um, uh, God, I read something, uh, it was snippet. I gotta get, it's John Barkley book, because it came from it. And how uh, Jobs, with the originally with the iPhone, didn't even want to participate with carriers. He was going after voice over IP, you know. And that's something that I, you know, that, that I you, you've seen me Twitter, uh, Twitter about. And then also, I hope Apple can decimate cable providers. God, I would love it if Apple could bring to us what they did with music, like a la carte with, with cable. Uh, I, I, I would personally like to see some offerings in pure data solutions that are provided in a way unmetered that they basically are true competition for the agalopoly of the telecoms. Because the reality is, and, and this is what has me especially pissed about Carrier IQ. The politicians are grandstanding, we'll protect you from Carrier IQ. The public is wanting to lynch Android and Carrier IQ. The people who are coming off smelling like roses are the ones who are responsible for the whole thing, the telecoms who ordered this be done. Nobody's mad at them. Congress is ignoring them. And Congress is the one who put them in the position that they could give the ultimatum. And the manufacturers could not say, no, we are not putting potentially spyware software on our phones. They didn't have a choice to say no if they wanted to sell their device. And that's just... <laughs> That's the reality of the situation we set up in the yeah, States. Yeah, you know, the carriers are so full of themselves. Now, I don't blame the vendors, because HTC and, and, and all of them, they just manufacture the phones. They have to deal with the carriers. Mm -hmm. let's, let's, be very, let's be very clear. Let's be very clear. AT&T and Verizon go out of their way. Sprint, all of them. I, I don't know much about the European market, so I'm not going to include something I don't know much about. But our U.S. carriers go to great lengths from branding of phones and total control of them, especially when it comes to Android. They make Android their own gosh damn thing. Look at Verizon. The whole Troy series is a Verizon creation. Carrier IQ is exactly for the carriers, and the carriers are not going to escape from this. I don't give a crap what the hell they say. This whole thing is built to make a service for the freaking carriers, and it is exactly that. Now, because like you said, Android by a certain shell access can be utilized uh, because because of the the, the uh, telephony uh, firmware connection. Mm -hmm. to yeah, the, and and that was how this system. was that, uh, that that was how they demoed this because it's the easiest way to show people what it's doing. Yeah, so what? I mean, okay, uh, it's not an Android flaw, nor is it an iOS flaw or an Apple flaw. Apple has to do its best to make its world private and have and have the carriers as, a, as an afterthought. And, and, and I, you know what? That, that's one thing I agree with Jobs on, is he, he did his best in two, you know, before the iPhone was first released to say, man, why can't we just talk over Wi-Fi? And I agree with Jobs, man. I, I, man, it's so shitty how we're, we're dealt this gosh damn cards uh, that we are with the, with the, with the cell carriers, and you and I have argued, not argued against each other, but argued together uh, against the the uh, shit that, that the consumer has to put up with with these freaking cell carriers. And they're not going to—I don't give them a pass. They can say all the bullshit they want and all the headlines they want. They're not getting a pass from me. They wanted to get in order data from us. They, they wanted to do diagnostic data from us using Carrier IQ, and they and they're not going to be allowed to back off. Is their problem? It's not iOS or Apple or Google. Well, and I don't necessarily even have a. I don't necessarily even have a problem with them requesting the software. 
I don't necessarily have a problem with the manufacturers giving in to their ultimatum. What I have a problem with is unless you root the phone, you can't kill it. <laughs> I, you have no way to, to opt out of the, well, I understand to diagnose things, you need this, but fuck you. <laughs> But what do carriers actually give a crap? It's just like you and I were discussing. They don't the have to. They've been granted a federally enforced autoopoly. Yeah. All right. See, this is the second time I've gotten enraged. All right. <laughs> oh.